Eric Trump told Fox News Monday that his father, President Trump, enraged critics with his campaign's Super Bowl ad because it showed the public that he could accomplish what Democrats had promised to do for decades. The ad featured Memphis grandmother Alice Marie Johnson, who was sentenced to life in prison for her role in a cocaine trafficking ring. She was released in June 2018 under the First Step Prison Reform Act, and the ad showed her overcome with emotion and thanking the president after her release. Sean Hannity, Rush Limbaugh's cancer announcement hit me like a Mack truck. Eric Trump said Democrats have pledged to reform the criminal justice system but have not taken serious steps to do so. It's one of the reasons they were enraged about the Super Bowl commercial, one was so proud of my father, he told Hannity, what he did with prison reform is incredible and justice reform, and that was one incredible case. He also praised socialite Kim Kardashian for her role in urging the president and Republicans to take action on the First Step Act. The president did something about it, and it's driving the Democrats nuts, that's something they tried to run on, that they would always promise and didn't get done and that reminds you of the Democratic Party in general, they always say they are going to get things done and they never do. Eric Trump said the president has fulfilled many of his 2016 campaign promises and that the First Step Act that freed Johnson and others will be a hallmark of his time in the White House. Other presidents promised they would do it and they never got it accomplished, host Sean Hannity repeated. Click here to get the Fox News app. The younger Trump added that he was shocked by the amount of support his father is receiving in Monday's Iowa caucuses, where he is running largely unopposed for the Republican nomination. He said he was met with chants of USA and cheers from a packed crowd outside the capital of Des Moines. President Trump faces two nominal Republican candidates in former Massachusetts Governor William Weld, the Libertarian Party's 2016 vice presidential nominee, and former Representative Joe Walsh, R. Ill, a radio host and Tea Party activist turned Trump critic.